welcome back to Connect to Terra in Denver, Colorado. I'm Jenna Dagenhart with Asset TV. I'm joined now by Jim Komoshevsky of AdvisorNet. Jim, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks for having me. And Jim, you recently became the president of AdvisorNet. What attracted you most to the firm? Well, I did. AdvisorNet's been around for 60 years now. And so it's, it's an organization that actually has deep tradition, um, but it's coupled with, they're always looking around the corner. So um, they, they know where the puck is going, right, in terms of the, this industry, well positioned, in fact, uniquely positioned for where the industry uh, is headed. In addition to that, it's employee and advisor own. So we make decisions based on those important factors. And it's also one of the largest regions within Cetera as well. It is, it is. It's one of the top regions, and of, of course that was attractive as well. Great, and um, throughout your career, you've pioneered multiple practice management programs for other broker-dealers in the independent space. What are some of the most important considerations that you found? I think there's one main one, and that primary consideration is the fact that every advisor's uh, experience, communication style, demographic, their practices are unique. And so we actually have to address those things specifically, treat the person and the practice as if though they're completely unique because they are. When we have an understanding of what the practice is, we can address those specifics, we're in a better spot. One quick example is someone in Manhattan uh, might have a completely different approach to their practice than someone in say West Des Moines, Iowa. Both great markets, great practices, but the approaches might be completely unique. When we can fill in those gaps and address the specifics, we can be more impactful for them. And finally, I want to ask you about some of your leading advisors. How do you help them take it to the next level in their career? They've already been very successful, but they want to reach that next level. Well, I think the most important thing that we can do as a firm for AdvisorNet specifically is make sure that they can leverage their time. The most important thing that they can do is spend that time and energy with their existing clients and their prospective clients. Uh, we have a comprehensive platform of services that allows them to do just that. They can do marketing and do, them just, do, do that just fine. They can do case management and financial planning, but when they can lean on us, they could have that time freed up to be in that revenue generating activity. I don't think there's anything more important that we can do for our advisors than that. Great, well Jim, thank you so much for your time today. Thank you for having me.